Good evening, let's wait for your classmates. Good night, teacher. Hey, good night. Good evening. Good evening. Let's see. Part two of the midterm. This other question, she told me they went out. She told me they went out. That up. Hmm. Okay, 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 okay. There are nine, eight. Try to turn on your cameras. We're about to start. I'm just checking the platform, answering to your classmates while we wait for the others. We're going to check the platform. Hey, good evening, Telma. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Fine, fine. Thanks. Uh, I looked. Uh, took these answers. The we went out last night. But it's the same. Uh, I told you uh, yesterday that that question, <clears throat> we went out last night. There's a comma. There's a comma at the end of the sentence. You could answer the same thing that you to typed with a comma at the end. She told me they went out last night. If you want to use that, then you say, she told me that day went out last night. Really? Yeah. I I I tried. I I I was I was uh, rewriting. Uh -huh. Rewriting. Rewriting. One hundred. <laughs> and uh, what is the thing? Okay, I will try it again. Thank you, okay. teacher. Oh, you're welcome. Don't worry. Okay, we are 14 already. Let me do the attendance so we can move on with the class. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. The present right after his. Andres Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present teacher. Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Present. Dora Elizabeth Flores Mendez. 
Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Erika Beatriz López Morales. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present teacher. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Francisco Amadeo Villacorta Chávez. Freddy Vladimir Cortés López. Please try to turn on your cameras. Remember, Glenda Laura Celada Renderos. Present. Amos Alfredo García Granadino. Present teacher. Thank you. Jose Alberto Salas Benítez. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Present. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. There. Present. Thank you. Stefania Carolina Reyes Sanchez. Present. Yeah. William Alexander Ramirez Flores. Present. Yeah. Jessica Yanari Cortez Diaz. I'm here. Great. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Roberto Luis Umaño Orellana. Suleyma Ivonne Moreno de Hernández. Irene Susana Cuellar Albanés. Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. And Thelma Clotilde Peña Martínez. Present teacher. Thank you. Teacher, okay. Uh, hey. Pastor Salas, I'm here. Uh, it was late a few minutes. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so tonight we're going to start the same way we did yesterday. You only have 15 minutes for this exercise, and then we will have 10 more minutes exactly. The first 30 minutes is just for you to practice having a regular conversation. Try to push, try to push yourself, you know, to speak more than what you do every day. So that's the whole point of the exercise. You still have the link on the WhatsApp group. Let me see, let me just reuse that link. Where is it? Here it is, okay. Here, okay, there you go. So that's the um, questions generator. We will only have 15 minutes for this activity and then I will bring some of you that didn't make it yesterday. Um, we're gonna do this only this week, you know, for you to practice. Uh, we have an, a speaking activity today at the end of the class as well. We're going to see a new grammar topic tonight, which is still using reporting, reported speech, I'm sorry, reported speech, but with weather, using weather in the middle of the questions. That's an interesting topic. So let's start the class. Please don't stay quiet change the questions, try to make at least five questions, you know, don't stick to one question, you know, just go with the next question, next question. In fact, just ask one classmate to answer the question, then another classmate or the person who answered can make another question. Okay. Got it. Okay, let's go. The link is on the WhatsApp group. Don't share it. Just talk, 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 talk. Let's go. Hello, good evening. Teacher. Hey. Could, could you please uh, explain what is the activity? Because I sent to connect, sorry for the late. 
but I have some problem with my connection. Yep, you just need to follow the link that I send you on the WhatsApp group. Ah, okay. And make a question to your classmates, one of your classmates, and then that person will throw another question and so on. The link okay. is to is for the questions generator. It will give you more questions, more questions. That's the point. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So, Yuri, do you prefer to travel or stay close to home? I prefer travel. Travel, trip. No, trip. Why? Why? Because is in that way you can know a lot of places and other cultures. Um, you can know many, many, many for many ways to that you can. For example, uh, something very simple: when you go to other country, the trees at the other way in other countries are different from this country. The everything is really different. Okay, Luis, what is your favorite TV show? Me? Yeah. Um, I, I don't have a, a, a favorite, but uh, recently I... Did you believe in... What is your least favorite part of your day? <laughs> uh, my least part of my day is the morning when I wake up because I usually uh, sleep late. But your favorite favorite part? Um. English colors at night. <laughs> <laughs> you said that because the teacher is here. We know that. <laughs> yes, yes. Puto. <laughs> yeah. You win one point. <laughs> yeah. You got one to start. Mm -hmm. What about you guys? Yes, right. I'm, I'm waiting for, for the class too, every night. <laughs> I believe you, I believe you. My favorite part is when I take a rest or a break and drink some coffee. Huh. Especially in the afternoon, right? Take a, a drink, take a cup of coffee is really good. Okay, Andres, I have a question for you. What do, what do you do on your most recent birthday? Birthday, I... Uh... I have a lunch with my family and I, with my coworkers, he, he, ha, he had a cake for me too. They have, they have a, a cake. Okay. 
fish. Okay, they fish, they practice fishing. Yes, fishing. And hunter, too. Uh, uh, yes. And make a fire. Okay. Uh, yes. Is in the ocean. Maybe uh, in the ocean or, or in this, I don't know. River, uh, jungle. Selva, mm, I don't uh, know. Yes. A forest. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. But that I. I uh, impression me when the, the always is a two people in the program, but in in, in un program the a, a woman y a, a man, a woman a, she have a she have a a, a live a, a program just only a man in the in the forest. Uh, uh, the men no 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 support well, the he doesn't uh, lonely no he he has a a, a pesadillas in, in the drama yes yes, yes. yes. But for me, you can live on a desert island. You can live. You can cultivate. You can catch the fish, catch fishes. Yes. And the problem is to, for me, is to create fire with the dry wood. It's a so difficult. Yes. So difficult because you have a dry wood. You have to to put in uh, together uh, uh, the dry wood for to get the fire. Um, for to sleep, you can sleep with 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 trees. Only that. Uh, it's not easy for loneliness. It's not easy in the promise. Uh, uh, can see the the loneliness. It's it's felt so difficult for many persons. Uh, Apart the food or, 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 or water. The water is a problem. The water is a problem, but, but it. But you when, can find, you can find. It's, it's, when, it's, it's, when, well, there, are, there are rivers. Siete, there are rivers, but uh, uh, it's no. You can you can drink the water. You can uh, generate a, another random question. Yeah. Ah. Could question you generate is... another another what? random question? Oh, okay. My question is: uh, What did you have for dinner last night? For dinner? Repeat. Okay. What did what did you have for dinner for di dinner last night? Dinner. Dinner. Okay. Okay. Teacher. What did you have for dinner last night? Last night. Uh, oh my god, I can't remember. Eight last night. Eight. Oops. I don't, I don't take my dinner, <laughs> actually. <laughs> <laughs> Two eggs. <laughs> only, only drinking, drinking coffee. Drinking coffee. <laughs> and, uh, I have a uh, two eggs. Como se dice? Estrellado, no me recuerdo. Oh. Uh, two eggs. Cooking, cooking, cooking eggs. Sunny side up eggs. What? Oh. Sunny side up eggs. Oh, okay. Oh. Travel eggs. Well, sunny side up. 
Okay. Con yeah. with sauce, with sauce of tomato, tomato. <laughs> with sauce, tomato sauce. Sauce tomato, tomato sauce, yeah. Oh. Tomato sauce. Mm, delicious, a, delicious. A, <laughs> uh, uh, Richard Tellis? X, X, uh, Mexican X. <laughs> Mexican eggs. Mexican? Well, Mexican sauce? Mexican sauce, yes. Yeah. Oh. Delicious, delicious, delicious. Tortilla soup? Yes. <laughs> ah, yes. soup. With tortillas. The soup is very Ooh. delicious. My favorite uh, soup is uh, ah, tortilla soup. soup tortillas. Yeah, soup tortillas, yes. Mm. <laughs> tortillas soup. Tortillas soup. Yeah. Mm. Yes. Mm. Thanks, God. Yeah, because uh, it's because I, I I want I want it, and then uh, how maybe pay it all uh, all teacher I'm um, adult. Teacher, are you there? Uh, I doubt. have a doubt. I have a doubt. Uh, I can say, um, deudas? Debts. Doubt. Oh, debt. 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 And pays okay. all debt. All, all debt. Yeah. And I, I, uh, would like, I would like to buy a house, a big house. Uh, I have a, I have two houses. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, me too. But I want to my I want that my family uh, live together. All my family live together. So I, I want I will buy a big house for all of them. Yeah. Okay. And Slema. Okay. Mm. Change the question. Okay. Okay. It's more fun. What is that? What is that? all the questions. <laughs> change, change, change. Next. Next. It's your turn, Jernari. Okay. You have to choose one. Okay. Let me. Let me see. Let me see. I don't understand a lot of questions. <laughs> I found I found one. Where is your? I know. I I, I know. <laughs> ah. <laughs> uh, where is your favorite place to shop? My favorite place to shop. Mm -hmm. I think that it depends the product. Depends. What do you want? What do you? What because do you when I when I have to buy food, I go to the super select. Okay. If uh, fast food, and if it's fast fast food, it is fast food. I don't know because I like. All the fat, the fast food. <laughs> I prefer the fast food. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. Talking to fast food, I think Subway is a good option. Yeah, yeah. Go, go green. And it's and it's a healthy option. 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 Go green. I think it's it's a healthy food. Right? That is yeah. not a fast food. No, but it's a uh, healthy food. <laughs> but whatever. Uh, what the other question is? What thing? What things are you passionate about? Mm. Mm. Maybe took care of of my dogs and it chocolates. Mm -hmm. And study English. 
<laughs> mm. I'm really passionate about K-pop. What? Just like what? I really pa passionate about K-pop. Mm. The Korean music. Mm. Mm. Ah, ah, I I ah. <laughs> yeah, the Korean music. Uh, what is that Korean music? Like BBS, Black TV BBS, and BTS? Yeah, oh, that's right. Yes. Uh, right. I, 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 I only know one song. Teacher. How do you say by the ego? Well, how do you say ego, right? Because pi is pi. Yeah, ego. Uh huh. Try search in it. It's big, but if you say big, big pie, big pie. Say... yeah, big pie. Big pie. Mm -hmm. Really? Why yeah, why not? Just remember that Can everything that F I G G F I. Fake. She worked like big pie. Big pie. Uh, right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. So before we move on, uh, let me let's correct something. A few points here. Another cultures. Let's say other cultures. Other plurals. Another singular, other cultures, other country, mm, another country. Okay, another country. Pronunciation, birthday. Mm -hmm. Can you say birth, birth, day? How do you do that? Just say birth, birth, birth day. Birthday. Mm -hmm. birthday. 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 That's right. Birthday. It's like this. Birth. Birthday. Birthday. Right. birthday. That's the right pronunciation. Z. Okay. Birthday. 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 Oh, my birthday. birthday. My birthday. My birthday. Mm -hmm. birthday. I had a lunch. Mm. I had lunch. I had <clears throat> a lunch for my birthday. I had a lunch for my birthday. Un almuerzo especial. Okay. I had lunch. I had breakfast. I had dinner. Pronunciation. Ocean. 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 <laughs> Ocean. 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 Pronunciation. River. Okay. River. 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 River view. Mm -hmm. It's a street name. River view. River. Okay. You have a dry wood. When you have a dry wood, okay, if you have dry wood, you cannot count dry wood. One dry wood, two dry wood, three dry wood. Mm. Mm. Okay. You have dry wood in general. For to sleep. Okay. To sleep is so difficult. Uh, okay. Hmm. Try to use this. It is so difficult to sleep. It is so difficult to sleep. It's so difficult to sleep in these circumstances. Okay, for many persons, for many people, people. plurals, persons, mm -mm, people. The water is a problem. Okay, the article, the, is used when you want to be very specific. In general, in my neighborhood, let's say water is a problem. Water is a problem in my neighborhood. Okay. 
I go to the super selectors again, very specific. I go to the super selectors near home. I go to the super selectors near home. Oh, the one near my house is very, very uh, convenient for me because it's the super selectors. I go to the super selectors near my house, near my home, near home. I'm sorry. It's very easy to get confused with that. Okay. Check the video. Let's go. Thelma, can you give me a number between one and 25? Me, teacher? Hello? Me tell, Hello? Me tell my yes. Give me a number between one and 25. 25? Mm -hmm. 25, okay. That's you. I don't understand it. <laughs> okay. Excuse me. Give me a number between one and 25. Any number. Just say a number. Say a number between one and 25. Um, Fernando. Okay, Fernando is number eight. But Fernando <laughs> spoke yesterday. Fernando, another number. Uh, 11. 11. 11, Glenda, Laura, Celada. Glenda, is Glenda here? Yeah, there she is. Okay, let's go with Glenda. Good, Glenda. Okay, your question. What movies have you rewatched the most number of times? What movies have you rewatched the most number of times? Um, more <laughs> because I had two 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 daughters and she likes uh, see the Moana and this is the movie that I see any times. Very good. You have two daughters. Yes. Repeat daughters. daughters okay i have two daughters they have seen moana multiple times okay what other movie have you seen multiple times can i turn off my camera because my internet is yeah it's fading don't worry bad. yeah you can do that Okay, give me a number between one and 25, Glenda. I think we lost her. Jocelyn, give me a number between one and 25. Okay, uh, 16. 16, Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Okay, Sandra. Okay, tu, 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 tu. what is your dream job? What is your dream job, Sandra? Hmm. And we lost Sandra. I need another number, Jocelyn. 17. 17, same question for Stefania Carolina Reyes Sanchez. What is your dream job, Stefania? I don't know. Maybe a uh, panda's keeper. <laughs> panda's keeper. Cute. Oh yeah. my God. Yeah. They're so cute. Why? And it's a good pay because they're so fluffy and it's well paid. Isn't that risky? No. No. Pandas are cute. No Why dangerous. I don't know. Yeah. So cute. They're crazy. And they're so funny. <laughs> yeah. They're crazy, actually. Okay, great job. Simple. Very good. Give me a number between 1 and 25, Stephanie. Um, five. Five. Okay, Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Is Edwin here? Yes, teacher. Excellent. Okay, your question. Okay. Uh, that's not a question. Mm. 
what are some things that you should not say during a job interview? What are some things that you shouldn't say during a job interview? I don't know, but it's not me, but someone is. The, yeah, somebody's, I somebody's dog. I couldn't hear very well. Uh, there we go. Yeah. Okay. Uh, when you go to an interview job, uh, something that I wouldn't say is the, about myself. I mean, about about my family or or about about things that the the guy the the for the companies they don't want to know. If I go to an interview job, I will say my experience about how it was. If I have experience in in that in, in that kind of company before. For example, um, two years ago, actually, I, I went to Concentrix and they asked me that question. And I start talking about I like play soccer, I like football, I like, they don't want to know nothing about that. They want to know about your experience, your ex jobs. Like that, that is the, 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 the guys want to want know about you. Um, and nowadays, I will try. I would try to go again. Actually, I talk about that. I used to work in teleperformance for for three years. I have some experience in, in in customer service and technical support and sales. I'm a good person talking with people. I have a lot of uh, a lot of things to to do and to improve in the company and things like that. But I I wouldn't I wouldn't say nothing about me because they don't want to know that. They want to know about my experience in my last job. Hmm? Mm, good. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Okay. Let's see. Many of you are, are not qualifying nouns. Interview job is the opposite. What kind of interview is it? A job interview. Okay. A television interview, a uh, radio interview. You can qualify the noun in this case the noun is interview so the adjective goes before a job interview pronunciation and you did it right later you said things 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 not things things uh, things 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 every time you see a th that's a z it's a z it sounds like a z okay and they ask me and they ask me when you speak fast, you tend to make this mistake. When they, they ask me. And it's past, right? They ask me, they ask me, they ask me. Okay. They don't want to know nothing about that. Double negative. How do you say that, uh, Jocelyn? They don't want to know nothing about it. Nothing about that. They don't want to know anything about myself. Excellent. Perfect. Instead of nothing is anything. They don't want to know anything about it, about that. They want to know nothing. You can do that. They want to know nothing about it. They want to. They want to know nothing about that. They don't want to. They don't want to know nothing about that. Uh, uh, uh you're no. double. You're doing it again. Okay. They don't want to know anything about that. They, they don't want to know anything about that. Or they want to know nothing about they that. They want to know about nothing about that. Uh huh. Practice this okay. too. This okay. Too. Good. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Good job. One more. Just one more, Edwin. A number between one and twenty-five. Um, fourteen. Fourteen, Judy. Sir. Okay. Easy for you, Yuri. Do you play any sports? Too easy. I uh, actually, no, but I, I frequently, um, I go with my family to run. Uh, uh, oh, uh, sport, You're watching sport. Um, let me see. No, no, no. Do you play? Um, um maybe bicycle is, I, uh, I like ride bicycle, but in, right now I, I I don't do a lot, but I I like it. For example, when I is um, the 
Tour de France, I like to watch. Is 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 a good uh, it's a good uh, it's a good sport. It's a good pro. It's a good uh, tour. And let me see what else. Uh, and just that's that's it. That's it. Okay. So you don't play any sports right now. Uh, if you were to play a sport, what will it be? Bicycle. Cycling. Okay. So you say cycling. Right? Cycling. I like to go cycling with my kids. I don't do a lot of sports. I don't do a lot. Of, why did I write that? I don't do a lot of sports. I don't do a lot. Of, oh, you said I don't do a lot. Uh, a lot of what? <laughs> Complete the sentence, right? I don't do a lot of that. I don't do a lot of sports. I don't do that very often. I don't do that much and so on. Okay. So this is the way you should be practicing. I uh, want to see, let me see, um, who, who looked for the YouTube video, the one minute, I'm sorry, just a minute, the jam technique. Did you research about the jam technique? No. Be honest, no. No. Okay, do it. Do it. Grab one of these questions, go to the mirror and just talk for one minute nonstop, nonstop. And then record yourself, listen to yourself, correct yourself, listening to yourself. That's very important if you want to learn, of course. Okay. Let's keep it rolling. For our next act, we only have 18 minutes to discuss together in small groups experiences okay experiences about what delivery issues teacher i have never ordered anything online really okay let's talk about pupusas <laughs> no 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 no. we're on a diet it doesn't matter have you ever ordered anything delivery service what happened what happened to you now keep it in english Keep it in English, okay? Tell your classmates what happened. What was your experience with the delivery? Um, I told you once a delivery problem I had with Pizza Hut. They, um, I ordered the full extra, you know, it's just ham and a lot of cheese. And my kids love that, right? So, and they didn't bring me that. They, br they brought me the, um, the other one. I can't remember the name of that pizza. The one with a lot of vegetables, onions, and everything, you know. And and I called, you know, the manager, and, he, and I said, hey, you know what? I, we couldn't eat that because the kids, you know. And he sent me a free a free order. He said, you know what? Keep that order. I'm going to send you another one, and you, you will just pay for one, okay? We're very busy right now, so. And I already have your order here, so there was a mixed up. That wasn't your order. I'm so sorry. And the good thing is that in 20 minutes, I had the other order on the door. I was like, eh, that's why I'm fat. Okay. So <laughs> it was a good experience with delivery. Okay. Have you had any bad experience? Want to hear you? I'll be there with you, listening to you. Please talk to your classmates. Don't stay quiet. If you don't have any experience, make it up. Make it up. Inventation. Come on. You can do it. Let's go. Practice or tell the experience about the deliveries. Deliveries, or if you don't have any experience of buying online, you can say uh, anything like, like if, like if you go to Burger King and you buy something you do, you don't like, you don't like, or you, or you didn't like the service or something, you okay. can invent. The teacher say, okay. <laughs> 
I I had a, a bad experience uh, like uh, one one month ago. Mm -hmm. uh, the restaurant said uh, uh, 1 p.m. I will have the, my order, but I have to wait like 40 minutes more. Where 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 that happens? Uh, here in Chalate. Okay. Where did that happen? Where did that happen? Where did that happen? Where did that okay. happen? It's okay. in a, a meat Mexican restaurant, but mm -hmm. they sell meats. Uh, they have a uh, good food, but delivery service is bad. Okay. I have I have, I have an experience with uh, something that I bought on, on internet. I remember many years ago when I visited my family over uh, in uh, in the United States. I bought a keyboard, and and I received really fast. Um, I, when I saw that big big box, I thought, "What is going? How many dollars I'm going to pay for that that box?" And then I called to the, at the, how do you say linea area? I don't know. Airline. 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 Sorry. The airline and asked, how much is it? Uh, how many dollars I'm going to pay for that box? And they told me, they told me, you're going to pay almost, I don't know. I don't know, but maybe 200 or something like that. Like a, it's a lot of money. And I decided to return the, this, this keyboard. And when I, when I wrote with the support on Amazon, they just told me, you, just, you need to print the label. And that label, that label had all the information about what is going to be sent that box, and that was really really easy. I, you don't you don't you don't. to buy today, uh, uh, but I, I don't I don't want to wait it for for that. Yeah. So that was my bad experience about about it. And I don't know. I just that remember. I remember that. Yeah, I think. So what about you? Remember, remember. <laughs> or make it up. Oh. Remember or make it up. Remember or make it up. Hamster. <laughs> when I, for example, when I order um, pupusas uh -huh. the last weekend, um, so they take my order. Uh -huh. They took your order. Mm -hmm. They took my order. Yeah, and then uh, two hours later, uh, the they, they don't bring. Uh -huh. They I, I I guess they they forgot Ooh. my order, so I have to to call again. And yeah, just remember. And then I I I have my my order in my in my house. Okay. How so? Do you remember? Well, I I don't have a bad experience uh, in delivery because here is is we don't have Google, uh, Google Apps, anything about, about it. 
but I remember um, we make an, an order in a, a pizza, Viva's Pizza, I, make, I remember the name of the pizzeria. Um, uh, we made the order almost at 6 p.m. and two hours later, uh, we call again and, 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 and they tell us that they came to send uh, our order and mm -hmm. we need to go to the restaurant and, and take, take it and because we here in, in a custom is at, at night is not easy to buy uh, food for the reason we we need to go went to the restaurant and buy the, the, the food and that was our experience with delivery we can use the service In the... yeah, most, of, most of the time, uh, the restaurant or the person who for our pound for pound or my money, and two months later, the, the, the cable appears in Correos in Correos in of El Salvador. So uh, that that was a bad experience because when I bought cables for something that day because I need I need now and wait a lot of time and, and had a, a back services in on deliveries is for me it's it works. And you Doris? Um, I for me uh, I don't have a problem with the service because I uh, no Frequently, frequently uh, uh, acts a service for delivery. In just only uh, hamburgers <laughs> or in Wendy, <laughs> but just only or, or pollo campestre, but no is frequently for me. Mm -hmm. And you? Mm, well, in my case, uh, I remember one time that uh, my co-workers and me, we order Pollo Campero. Uh, I work in Zona Franca Pedregal. This is like too, too close to the airport. Um, well, uh, we order uh, uh, some combos. Uh, they take the order and the, um, how do you say? Uh, they, the, 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 the customer service submit the order in the system. However, maybe 12, 30 minutes, they, they was called, called, called him. Um, they say that they, they don't know have a cobertura, how do you say, Tisha? Coverage. Coverage in this zone. However, they can send the orders uh, with a double, uh, extra cargo, an additional charge, uh, additional charge, charge, or charge, uh, around twenty dollars. Is more. Okay. see how it goes really quick let, let's correct something else let's see 
main area of improvement for everybody in this classroom, simple past. Um, let me do this bigger. It's on 36 already. Can you see the letters? Yeah. Make them bigger. Yes. Make them bigger anyways. Okay. Uh, let me see some of the guys that have always been with me for five months already. Let's see. Uh, Fernando, how do you read this sentence? I bought a keyboard. Hmm. Suleima, how do you read this sentence? I bought a keyboard. Suleima, you have your voice is so deep right now. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I, but I'm but sorry. he did it right. I, but he... I, I don't. I, I didn't see that. Yeah, I, <laughs> Come on. I, I, no, I didn't you, did mute. It right. <laughs> you did it right. Oh, you were not on mute. You were not on mute. You didn't notice you were on mute. I didn't notice I was on mute. I wasn't on mute. I wasn't muted. I wasn't muted. Okay. Yeah. You heard? I bought a I bought a I bought a keyboard. I bought a keyboard. Suleima, help me with the next one. Easy. I thought. I thought Sule I told you. Okay. Yeah. I thought I told you. Okay. Americans, Americans actually eat the subject in this sentence. Thought I told you. It hurt? Man, told you. thought I told you. Man, thought I told you. Okay. Okay. Easy. Next, Jocelyn. I called to the airline, but it should be a call the airline. <laughs> you got it. That's my girl. I Why called the airline. Excellent. I called the airline. Uh, no preposition. That's right. I called the airline. Yep. Excellent. Now, what's the, uh, the error here in grammar? How many dollars I'm going to pay? How much I will pay? I will pay for that. Am Perfect. I it's not a grammar mistake. It's just because it is, it, this is proper grammar. How many plurals? Okay. I'm going mm. to pay. Am I going to pay? How many dollars am I going to pay? Am How I? many dollars am I going to pay? Okay. What's the other way of saying it, Alexander? Just, uh -huh. How much? How much money? You don't, you don't even need to mention money, right? Because how much is for money, right? How much okay. will I pay? How much will I pay? How much am I going to pay? How much am I going to pay? Okay. I decide to return this keyboard. This doesn't sound like pass. Remember, I decided. I decided to return this keyboard. Okay. You don't, uh, again, pronunciation, right? You don't want to know. Uh -uh. You don't want to know. You heard? You don't want to know. You don't want to know. Man, you don't want to know. I thought I told you. Can you do you don't want to know. Okay. Can you repeat, please? <laughs> yes. Okay. Don't say you don't want to know. That doesn't sound American. You have to say you don't. Okay. You don't. You don't. Know. You don't. You don't want to know. There you go. Man, you don't want to know. You don't want to know. You don't want to know what, know what I'm saying. You don't, you don't know what I'm. You don't know what you're saying. You know. You don't know. You don't know. You don't know. You don't know what it's like. Uh -huh. You don't know. You see, easy. Love somebody. We make an order again. This sounds. This doesn't sound like past. We made an order. How else can you say when you make an order? Place. We place an order. We order food. We ordered something. Okay. Try to think twice. Think twice. That that's my advice. They tell us, and in fact, who said this? Try to say, try try to do this. They told us, and I was like, mm, wait, told, mm -hmm. told. They told us. Very good. We need to went and buy it. What's the right way? We need to go. Hmm. We need to go. We needed to go. Listen, we needed to go. We needed to go. We needed to go. Man, you have a D and a T between two vowels. 
So definitely you have to do that. We needed to go. We needed to go and buy it. Okay, we needed to go and buy it. I have no, I no have a problem. What's the right I way? No I have no problem. That's better than I don't have a problem, right? I have no problem. Oh, oh well, well, it depends. If you want to say a problem, then yes. No. I don't have a I don't have a problem. I don't have a problem. I don't have a problem. I have no trouble. I have no problem at all in my life. But I don't have a problem with that specific. And please don't do this. Don't combine just and only. Okay. Whether you say just or you say only, okay? Next, no is frequently for me. Uh, it is not. It's not. like tr the who said this was trying to say, I don't do this very often. It's like when you want to say that you don't do that very often. And that's the way you say it, right? I don't do this very often. It's not something that I do very often better i don't usually i don't usually do this now why does this happen noise frequently for me okay mm -hmm. because you're not thinking about the structure no usual okay. um i don't usually do this okay i don't usually do this uh, okay etc they they was call him they uh-huh help me call him they, they were calling they him. were okay you want to use past continues okay they were calling him they called him or they were calling him how do i correct this grammar small errors at this point this structure errors then simple okay you can grab you can do a diet a diet okay can somebody help me what is the diet that i always recommend you guys Eating vegetables, no. Italian. Five. Will, William, give five. me a verb. An intermediate five verb, William. Mm. Don't say cook, don't say pay, eating, don't say. Eating cereal. Eating cereal. Uh, no, no, no. It is basic. Come on, intermediate five verbs. Mop. Mop. Ah, come on. Okay, mop. <laughs> Which means, use your beautiful Spanish. What's the meaning of mop? Oh my God, this keyboard, I hate it. Trapear. Oh my God, trapear. Trapear. Ministerio de Obras Públicas, teacher. Excuse me. Right, okay. Is that the way you write tra trapear? Yeah, right. Okay, yeah. in, in Spanish. Okay, now give me a word related to this verb. Uh, clean. Mm -hmm. clean? And this is clean a... is a verb. I'm asking clean for no. words. No. Floor? More difficult. Mm. Mm. How the do dirt. you dirt. the dirt? Yeah. That sounds better. What's dirt? Sucio. Okay. Suciedad o suciedad. Okay. So we have a verb, we have a word. Okay. Now, what do we do? There are four or five different ways of speaking in English in all grammar tenses, right? My God, what time is it? It's 9.04, really quick, in two minutes. So pay attention. You can do this diet. Five verbs. Okay, oh my God, hold on. Okay, again, five verbs with their word. With nouns, okay. Every day, just grab five verbs with their nouns, and then you start positive, negative question. 
if you want to do something extra, do the WH question, the open question, okay? So how do you do it? What's the, what's the, um, what's the sentence? Alexander, what is the sentence? Let's do present simple. Okay. And the floor was so dirt. Mm. You got mm. complicated. Okay. I mop the ground. Mm. No, yeah. Mm. I'm I mop the, the floor. floor. I mop I mop the dirt floor. Dirty floor. Dirty. Yeah, you could say that. I mop the dirty floor. Um you could also say I mop I mop. What is the pass for mop? Mopped. Like that? Double P, I Double guess. P. Why? Because you have consonant, vowel, consonant, right? Yeah. Yeah, so you double the P. That's the rule. Okay, I mop the dirt, the dirt from the floor. Okay. I mopped the dirt from the floor. I mopped the floor. I mopped the uh, dirty floor. Okay. What would be the negative, Doris? Oh, we went to pass, right? I didn't uh, want to go to pass. Okay. Uh, I'm up the dirt. The, uh, the, with using the mops? The same or... sentence. The same sentence. We're going to use it in simple present. Uh, I mop. Hmm. Negative? I don't like mop. <laughs> okay. I don't. I don't like mop and you don't need like and this is the point with this exercise you can mm -hmm. simply modify the next okay sentence just adding what you need in this case you just need the auxiliary right mm -hmm. you see and that's it mm -hmm. okay the auxiliary how do you make a question uh amos Make do the question, please. Okay. <clears throat> what kind? Mm, same same sentence. Mm, oh. Um. Okay, uh, how do you start a yes, no question? Do, Jessica. Sorry. Do, uh -huh, the auxiliary, right? Do. Do. Exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, do, do you, I, do, do I? You, do you, why? She up the dirt. Do you, why? Do you mop? You mop the dirt from the floor? Or do you swipe it? Okay, so WH question, Jessica Yanari. I don't know if is, is this correct. Mm -hmm. When do when do you mop the That's dirt? It. You got it. When do you mop the dirt from the floor? So mm -hmm. here, here you have one set. Now you can grab another verb another word and go positive, negative, question, WH question. You're done, okay, let's do another one. So you do that five times, okay? You do this for, I don't know, as long as you leave, for as long as you leave. Why? Because Monday you do simple present, Tuesday you do simple past, Wednesday you do Past continuous, Thursday, past perfect, present perfect, whatever you want to do. Grab a book, a notebook, grab a notebook and do this. Teacher, but I, I already used all of the verbs that I know. Okay, get up. Oh, I haven't sent you the list of verbs. I always send a list of verbs on, on every group when we start. I'll send you a list of verbs so you can do this. If you want to learn, there are some gaps. 
there are some gaps. I have gaps. Do you know what are gaps? Some empty spaces in your brain. I have empty spaces in my brain regarding words. You think that I know every word in English? No. Okay. Sometimes I struggle. I struggle with some words from CNN, you know, watching CNN in English, I still go like, mm, because I have never been to the States, okay? And so on. So follow my advice, change the grammar tense every day and do five verbs, five words, positive, negative question, open question. Got it? Got it. Y en especial si sientes que te quedas trabado con tus compañeros. Ooh, okay, that's urgent for you. Okay, let's do the attendance. It's 9-11 already. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. Oh my God, this computer is going to kill me. Hold on. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Take your time. It is Tuesday, right? Okay. Andres Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present. Thank you. Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Present. Thank you. Dora Elizabeth Flores Mendez. Present. Bien. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Present. Erika Beatriz López Morales. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Francisco Amadeo Villacorta Chávez. Here. Bien. Freddy Vladimir Cortés López. It was there. Glenda Laura Celada Renderos. Present. Glenda, we stay for 10 minutes, okay? At the end of the class. Okay. Good. Thank Amos you. Alfredo Garcia Granadino. Present here. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Present teacher. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Present. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Estefanía Carolina Reyes Sánchez. Present. William Alexander Ramirez Flores. Present. Good. Jessica Yanari Cortez Díaz. I'm here. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Roberto Luis Umaño Arellana. Zuleima Ivonne Moreno de Hernández. Present. Irene Susana Cuellar Albanés. But I saw Irene. Nope. Okay. Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. Present. And Thelma Clotilde Peña Martinez. Present. Awesome. Teacher. Hey. You forgot to say my name, Jose Salas. Really? Yep. No way. My name, too. Are you kidding me? Yeah. <laughs> what? Where are you? Fernando, yeah. Yes. Yeah, I'm only missing Erica today. And Irene. You didn't. Okay. 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 Got you guys. I got you. Okay. So let's talk about grammar. Man, this topic of reported speech is very extensive. Some teachers don't like it. But you know what? This is one of the topics that I like from the book. If you have noticed during this module, we have been talking only about reported speech. But it's always the same. I like the fact that you have, you, you have to remember this. That's it. Simple present, simple past. Simple past, past perfect, and future would or will would. Okay. So the same thing. Now we need to use whether or if or if or whether. Okay. Now these are introduced by this clause. What is the grammar involved in this or the structure, let's say? We need to use ask, want, to know, okay? Whether you say ask or you say wanna know, and then you use this clause, if or whether, okay? Let's look at some examples. Is there a special discount for this product? Reported speech using whether or if. The customer asked whether there was a special discount for the product. What is the meaning of weather? Somebody. 
Sí. sí. In sí. Spanish. Sí. Ya sé. Sí. Sí. Only sí. No. Ya sé. Sí. Ajá. This actually implies el ya sea qué. Ya. Yeah. So, el cliente preguntó ya sea qué. Ok. Y en este caso, como decía Alexander, se entendería como el si hay, si había, si había un descuento especial. Ok. Different. If you use if, it's the same thing. It is the same thing. So, can this be purchased in the UK or only in the US? Customer asked whether the product could be purchased in the UK or only in the US. The customer asked if the product could be purchased in the UK or only in the US. If you say whether here, the customer asked, el cliente preguntó, ya sea que el producto se pueda comprar en um, United Kingdom o solo en los Estados Unidos. Mm -hmm. Sí, el producto. Okay. Let's keep that in mind. You're giving a condition, and, let's say, and uh, the, in this case, it's a condition, okay? And in the second, you're giving two options. You can play with that. Questions so far? Okay, no, no questions? Okay. Let's look at the next example, but I'm tired of speaking. I don't want to talk too much. Blanca, simple past, past perfect. Go ahead. Okay, customer. Was I charged for shipping? Report a speech. Oh my God. <laughs> Just... <laughs> Report a <Go> speech. <laughs> the customer asked, if he had been charged for shipping. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. You did it right. Asked uh -huh, if he had been charged for shipping. Uh -huh. okay. Was I charged Customer, for shipping? Mm -hmm. did the package arrive? Reported. The customer want to know whether the package had arrived or not. Do it with me. Wanted to know. Wanted to know. Wanted. Wanted. Wanted to know. Uh, repeat with me. Wanted. Wanted. Yeah. Wanted. To know. To know. Okay. Like that. Wanted to know. Wanted to know. Okay. Wanted to know. Wanted to know. Wanted. Wanted. To know. To know. Okay. I'll say with me. I wanted to know. I wanted to know. Okay. She the customer wanted to know. Wanted to know. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Customer wanted to know whether the package had arrived or not. Okay. Reported, reported speech, reported. Okay. So simple past. Was I charged for shipping? The customer asked if he had been charged for shipping. Now in this case is a mail. We and is in the context. And this is what you're not paying attention to on the exercises on the platform. It says at the top, at the top it says, who is the speaker? Who is the speaker? Just be careful with that. Other than the errors, of course, and I'm sorry for that, but yeah. So just follow the rule. Is it simple past, future, present? So you follow these rules. Simple past, you use past perfect. Do you remember the structure for past perfect? Stefania, what is the structure for a positive sentence using past perfect? Oh my God, I can't remember. Okay. <laughs> Help me guys, everybody. How do you make a, uh, how do you formulate a, sim a past perfect structure? Subject. Subject, uh-huh. Uh, Past participle. Uh -huh. uh, 
Okay. There you go. What's the negative structure? Subject had plus not plus better in past past participle plus mm -hmm. complement. You got it. Okay, and a question. Uh, hat mm -hmm. plus subject <laughs> plus ever. Mm -hmm. Really? No. no, like me. Yeah, it's a question, but it's not needed to use it ever. Not necessary. You can do it. It sounds good, actually. Okay, so had subject past participle. Past participle. Complement. And don't forget the question mark. Now that's a yes, no question. WH. Okay, what about a WH? El 90% de las reglas gramaticales, estructuras gramaticales, siguen la misma regla de que a una pregunta cerrada, una yes, no question, solo le vas a agregar una WH al principio y ya tenés una pregunta abierta. Ok. What? What? Ok. There you go. That's the structure. So if you follow that formula every day on your notebook for the next week or this week, every day you discipline yourself and you do positive and negative question, open question with one bird, one word every day, every day. Teacher, I have no time. I don't have time, teacher. You go to the bathroom, right? In your job. Yeah, so take your notebook to the, to the bathroom. I have no time to go to the bedroom time nobody has time you have to make the time okay that's a structure for past participles i mean for the uh, sorry that's perfect and last let me see ta -ta -ta. luis you're so quiet will wood Okay. Uh, will, will customer will the laptop be delivered on Monday before the speech um, the customer inquire if the laptop will be delivered on Monday perfect mm -hmm. <clears throat> customer will the shipping cost increase with premium delivery or not Reported okay. speech. The customer asked if the shipping cost would increase with the premium delivery. Simple. Thank you, Luis. That was awesome. Just delivery, delivery. Okay. It's the same thing. The customer asked if, okay, the shipping cost will increase with the premium delivery. Just don't forget, would any model if you read the pdf that i shared with you you will notice this every model and this is a general rule for every model there is a base verb after the model mm -hmm. that's just the way it is it's a general rule and it's the same structure Same structure all the time. You bring the model to the front to make a question and so on. Okay, questions? No. Yes. Yes, please. I have a question. Okay. This incorrect is for, for future, we use could be in, inside of wood. Here? Yes. Instead of, instead of wood? Yes. No, you can do that. Actually, you can do um, it. Okay. What's the difference? Mm. Maybe change the verb, no. How does it change the verb? Yes, would affects directly the verb. Would increase, incrementaria. 
If you say could increase, mm -hmm. podría incrementar. Yeah, there's not much difference, okay? Now, this is more unreal than could increase. There's a slight chance that there will be an increase, okay? That's the difference. Could is more imperative than would. That's the difference. Oh, okay. Got it, you got it. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. So let's work on this together because we have to prepare a small presentation. What are we gonna do? Follow these examples. What do you need to do? You need to create a role play. And a role play following the examples. Okay, one is the customer, the other one is the delivery guy, the other one is the restaurant or the manager if you want. Just be creative. Um, okay, picture this, picture this, and let me get inspired a little bit. Okay, there, there, should, there must be two scenarios, two scenarios, okay? Two scenarios, two scenarios. I like to say, I like to, to use this with my customers when they call me and I have to give them options, right? Suppositions, because they call and say, hey, you know what? Somebody stole my money from my card. And I typically go like, don't worry, we're here to help you. Yeah, how are you gonna help me? Are you gonna give me back my money now? And I go like, relax. Let me explain you what we're gonna do first. We will send you an email. So you can send us some documentation, okay? And with these documents, you authorize us to do an investigation and find out who took your money illegally. Yeah, but that's not gonna help me. You're not getting back my money. We will give you back your money eventually, okay? This will take some time. And I like to say this, so number one, we will give you back the money. The worst case scenario, the worst case scenario, okay? We, will, we won't be able to give you back the money, but that's readily, that, that, that readily happens. That readily happens, okay? And I like that phrase, the worst case scenario. Okay, let's picture, I, I tell them, okay, let's picture, let's picture the worst case scenario. What is the meaning of this phrase? Can somebody help me? <clears throat> the worst situation that can happen. It could. It could happen. Mm -hmm. You got it. Let's picture the worst, the worst case scenario. Let's picture the worst case scenario. And when I talk to them like that, you know what happens? I think that's, a, that's part of it. You know, is when you talk to an American, they get fooled they get fooled by me because they think that I'm American too. <laughs> when I use this type of phrases and they go like, this guy is not, is not a, a wetback, you know, he's not a Latin person. So that gives them trust. Somehow that gives them trust. They feel more confident, you know, talking to you because you're assuring, you're assuring to them, you're giving them what could happen, you know, what would be the worst that could happen and so on. So going back to the point, um, scenario one. Okay, I'm the customer, somebody else is the salesman. Okay, um, hello, um, I would like to order a pizza. Okay, Fernando, help me. Okay, uh, what could happen? If I order a pizza? No, no, maybe. no. Follow me. I would like ah. to order a pizza. You're the pizza guy. Ah, okay. Okay. But what kind of pizza do you want? Okay, I would like to order the um the four seasons. Okay. And what kind of uh what do you say masa? <laughs> what kind Mas. of dough? Mas. Uh, what kind of dough? What kind of 
Um, the thick, the thick one. Okay, the thick one. Okay. Hey, can, can I order half of it and one speciality and the other one on another, a different speciality? Yes, but uh, that that is an extra cost because the, the promotion uh, the promotion was uh, uh, only the the forest station pizza without the specialities. Oh, that's not so good because we're we don't like that much. You know the pineapple pizza. How much more should I pay? Uh, if you want, it's the pen of the speciality because if you want two or more specialties, you have to pay one dollar for, for each? each speciality. Yes, Spe specialty. I think we're saying the Special, wrong word. Yeah, we're just in the wrong word. <laughs> okay, okay, that's it. So, report the speech. Oh well, let's continue with the um, with the scenario. The second scenario. The second scenario is you can receive the order. So Fernando must give the order to his boss, okay? And go like, hey, you know what? I'm Fernando now. I just received an order. The customer ordered uh, four stations pizza. And the boss will go like, oh, really? And what else did they ask for? Well, she, he was, huh? He asked me if we had, because it's past, right? He asked me. She. He asked me if we had, uh, if we could change, if we could change, the the four different seasons, you know, the four different flavors for specialities. And what did you say? Oh, I told her. I told him that yeah, but there will be an extra charge, right? Good. And what happened then? Did he order? What did he order in the end? Yeah, the guy paid the four dollars, you know, for each part of the pizza to be on a different flavor. Okay. Was he happy? No, he asked me if, if he could pay with credit card. Okay. Did you place the order? No. Okay. For example, right? You're narrating what happened in a conversation. Okay. You want to go farther? You can still go farther. I'm the customer again. Hello. Ring. <laughs> Ring. Oh my God, they closed the pizzeria. Ring. <laughs> Fernando answered the ah, question. Ah, okay. 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 <laughs> I, I only, I, I, I think because you are only dramatizing. The moment. Yeah, go ahead. Follow me. Follow ah, okay. Me. Okay. Hi. Hey, I just placed an order for a four stations pizza with four different, well, I paid the additional extra. Uh, you know the additional four dollars. What happened to the order? Oh, let let me check in the system for the delivery guy. Oh. Can you give me a minute, please? Okay. Le pon la cancioncita. <laughs> okay. Remember, he he's on hold, right? I said no order was placed because I wanted to pay with a credit card, right? Remember? Yes. Oh. Uh oh. Uh, excuse me, let, let me check the, if the order was placed or maybe uh, was the system uh, have, had a, a virus functionality, <laughs> something like that. Let me check. Technical issue. Oh, uh, come on. There's a virus on the system. It's eating the pizzas. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So here's the point. I will go like, hey, what happened? No pizza? No order? No. You didn't find it, right? You know what? I knew this was going to happen. Um, I talked to this guy and I told him that that I needed to place an order. And, and he asked me if I wanted to pay in cash or if I wanted to use a credit card. When I told him that I want to use a credit card, he hung up. I thought he had placed the order because he gave me the total and he asked for my card information. In fact, what do we do? That's the point. You got it? So you follow the line. You're reporting. Try to report to someone. Make sense? 
Yeah. Okay, uh, really quick. Uh, in Spanish, Andres Giovanni explained to the class, what are we doing? Como creando una conversación para, para pedir un, algo. Okay. Mm -hmm. What else? What do we need to use? Reported speech, did you say? Reported speech, right? Try to use the mm -hmm. questions, everything that you have seen with reported speech. And what is the topic? Delivery service. Delivery service. Poor delivery service, good delivery service, whatever you want, but do it okay with your classmates. I'm gonna split you right now so we can create these conversations. You're gonna be in smaller, uh, it's just different groups. Okay, you got it. Let's do it. I have a question. Hmm? We need to do the um, simulacro, no, teacher? Role play. A role play. Role play, sorry. Mm -hmm. That's okay, don't worry. We have to do a role play, that's right. <laughs> Be creative. Hey, Stephanie, have a good, good English skill. Sorry, I don't understand what you said. Did you have good English? Oh. Everybody does. Everybody does here. Everybody does, yes. Come on. Figure out the role play. What is the product? What's going to happen? Just create the plot. Start start with the plot. How's the plot? La trama. No. Mm. <laughs> Remember, every story has a beginning, a plot, and an end. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Let's go. So what's it going to be, guys? Maybe we, we should. The promotion. Promotion of the night. What cup do you want? With mushrooms, ham, extra cheese, pineapple, apple, pickles. We will send it always to his, to his house. We're going to, okay? I invented it, okay? Do you understand me, guys? Yeah, yeah. Yes, we understand you. Okay, it's a, it is a, a speech like the like the when you have a call center, when one person orders the one product for your company. Well, and that the, is when that when the customers uh called and the yes. agent answer all, all uh all the all the things that yeah. you have that you say right now, right? Yes, for, for example, hi thank for calling to. Happy pizza, this is the name. La pizza feliz is the name. Okay. You call him to happy pizza, is the, the normal. Happy and after that, I speak with Lopez family. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What does Don Carlos want tonight? And Don Carlos has one. Okay? And the, the call center, we know the speech, and the speech, you want to sell one promotion that you have. And we invite. To you, a special promotion five pieces for the price of one. This is the promotion, yeah. And the call center, the, the cost, the call center told to the customer, What type do you want? Mushroom, ham, extra cheese, pineapple, apple, whatever, whatever. And after that, where we send it always to his house, yeah. This is okay. this is this is a script, okay? This is a script when you have a call center for to sell something, yeah. 
and that information is in the software in the call center. Guys, come on, guys, teamwork, teamwork. You gotta do this together. Hello. Hello, teacher. What are you up to? Uh, we didn't start to to make it properly. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Remember you have, well, we are still missing like 14 minutes, 14 minutes still. Okay. It's a role play. That's it. It's just a conversation. Okay. Place an order. Can I order? Can I order one hamburger? A hamburger. Can I order a, a hamburger? With a, que alguien uh, me dijo, alguien me corrigió eso, que hamburger. Fry fresh. Fry fresh. <laughs> solo se le dice burger, me dijo alguien. That was me. Burger. <laughs> He is running. No, but you're okay. You're, burger. You can say hamburger. Burger. Yeah, burger. I want to order a burger. Burger. Yeah. Burger. It's more informal. Teacher, I need some help with the platform. Not right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, text me, text me. Text me, but give me the, the exercise number. On Saturday. No, oh, you can do it. After the class, okay. just text me so I can tell you what's going on with it. Remember, you're doing a role play right now, a role play. It's a conversation. And then you're going to report what someone else told you. Okay. Allow me just a minute, okay? Keep it up, guys. Come on. Can I... Oh, can I or may I? May I get a, a burger? May I? I, I, may I order a burger? Right, uh, fresh. With uh, French fries. Ahí te preguntan what kind of meal va o oh, what kind of burger si va. The meal is a uh, is a uh, is a uh, the the burger of the menu.
Quiero ver. No te estés haciendo eso, lavate la mano. Ok, don. Ok. Continue. Don. Ok. Ok, good morning. Right, How can I help you? Hi, this is Ella Winston, down for chocolate to sure. Janet, contain the strawberry flavor, please. Okay, my address is blah, 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 blah. And Jos Josue will give me the order to to bring to the customer. Mm, yeah, but yes. I, I need uh -huh. I need the name and the address. Okay. Okay. I, it's already done. Okay, my daughter is this, my phone and my name. Please, I request it done for a birthday party. Please be on time. Please try to be on time. Okay. Now uh, the order passed to you to the delivery guy. Yeah. Uh-huh, okay. Jose, Josue, what are you going to talk to Fernando? And Fernando is working in Hugo Eats, Hugo, Uber Eats, or what is your company? Yes. Fernando's company, Fernando's delivery. <laughs> yeah. So I... Uh, I am in the place. So Josué, uh, mm -hmm. he is in charge of or give me the the order. Yes. Mm, yes. For example, uh, Josué can tell, "Hey Fernando, we got a we got an or we request for an order, and the address is in the the order is ready. Please, you are the guy who will be assigned to deliver to the person. Y ahí donde me puede decir él, el cliente dijo. The, the, the customer said. Here. Spanish is not allowed. <laughs> because, <laughs> okay. The, custo, the customer said if, if, uh -huh. if you if you could uh, be on time be because on time, uh -huh. huh? Yeah. Because they want for a birthday party. Y por ir tan rápido. Not Spanish. <laughs> okay, I don't understand the Spanish right now. Okay, but please, uh, I will add this information to the conversation, but please. Uh, Okay, I will do my best. Okay, suppose the Josue will talk before my before my thoughts right. Hey Fernando. Uh, yeah, I think that we we have to we have to uh, use the will or wool. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or yeah. not because the because person, maybe. the delivery well the 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 buying process uh, it's in the past because there is forty five days in for the day I that the, we want to the... represent it it has to be the wheel or wood. So okay, okay. Blanca. What do you want to start? 
the conversation. Hi. Hi, I wanted to know if you send me my smartwatch because I already paid that, paid for that. And uh, I don't know how mm. to say it, it takes 45 days and I didn't receive the 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 product mm -hmm. or something like that. Don't think to, to sound better. That's okay. It sounds good. You didn't okay. receive the product. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, who, who who's going to be the, the seller? <laughs> um who's going to be the the support customer service support okay can you help me with that i'm very mad <laughs> uh luis could be the customer, customer service, service agent okay Okay, I'm thinking. Um, you uh, read what um, Blanca says, please. Hello. Hello. I'm right. I'm writing right now to to say it again. This this is the part of Blanca. I guess I will receive my. Yes, Blanca. Que presentar la declaración. Así es así. You will, will you have a, a return the the text? No, depends. 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 I have to pay for four hundred dollars. How many? Four hundred. Four hundred dollars. Oops, yeah. sorry, sorry, Jessica. Sorry for you. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, I because I, 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 um, teacher. I, I don't know how can I say. Uh, how can I say? Presto mis servicios. Service professional. I give my services. Oh, thank you. But service professional, because it's different service. I, get, uh, I, yeah, give, my, I, give, I service. give my professional services. Yeah, professional yeah. service, yes. I give yes. my professional service, thank you. And and the uh, companies discount me 10% taxes yeah. for my fees. Yes, oops, uh -huh. I know, I know. Yeah, but um, I'm, I'm a salary. I, 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 I work for... For a government, and you have two two salaries. Yeah, you yeah, have, yeah. You, have, you have to pay more for... because you work for the government. <laughs> but I have different uh, uh, per fees and yeah. salary, and and they they the the um, uh, hacienda haciendas do. Uh, uh, recalculate, or how can I say? Yeah, recalculate. Recalculate. They, yes. have, they, they so need to recalculate. It's so, it's so difficult. You have to. Have, no, you know. no, no. It's not difficult. It, it's easy because I do yeah, that. But but you have to have many uh, that you sell the 
the the last the, the last year and and what do you pay? Yeah? I'm sorry. Are we placing an order or delivering or talking about? Ah, yes, sorry, teacher. The bad experience of the delivery. I'm, I don't remember that you had you had to build a conversation, right? Yeah, yeah. And then report what someone told you. Okay. Okay. Well, 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 well. Um. That is where that, well, that the conversation. Will, do Do you remember driving? Yeah, mal. Your order uh, is uh, um, uh, 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 the order okay. For example, when when you when, uh -huh, the the seller is taking is is going to talk with the uh, um delivery or who? No, the with uh, the manager. With the manager or with someone else that is going to prepare, for example, the the, the custom the customer wants a burger grill. A uh, chicken burger grill with all vegetable. Uh, the the customer. This customer ask. The customer ask. Um, let me let me see the structure. The no. customer ask. Um, the, the, ask the, 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 the rider, the arrive last last time. So, uh, uh, what are the team? Out of time. Out of time. It is for example, let me let me let me understand. The, or I don't know. Let me see. <clears throat> the customer asks as um uh, if the order is free for the problem of the time of the time yeah oh, see good idea excellent Maybe. idea mm -hmm. mm. Present. Exactly. Thank you. Okay, guys, we will. I'll give you some minutes tomorrow so you can present. Okay, um, the dialogue with your classmates. Okay. What? Okay. <laughs> text. Text among each other. You know, on the on the WhatsApp group tomorrow during the day review the conversation you will have the whole day tomorrow okay alexander de jesus sanchez soto present good night good night andres giovanni valdivieso portillo present good night blanca stephanie navarro flores dora elizabeth flores mendez present present good night present edwin alexander ayala erazo Present. Good night, teacher. Good night, Erika Beatriz Lopez Morales, Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present, teacher. Good night. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Good night. Good night, Francisco Madeo Villacorta Chavez. Present. Freddy Vladimir Cortez Lopez. Good night. Glenda Laura Celada Renderos. Present. Eimos Alfredo García Granadino. Present teacher, good night. Good night, Josué Alberto Salas Benítez. Present, good night. Good night, Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Present, good night. Good night, Luis Ernesto Romero Arguet. Present, good night. Good night, Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present, good night. Good night, Stefania Carolina Reyes Sánchez. Present, good night. Good night, William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Good Jessica night. Yanari Cortez Diaz. I'm here. Good night. Good night. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Good night. Good night.
Roberto Griso Maño Orellana, Zuleima Ivón Moreno de Hernández, Irene Azucena Cuellar Albanés, Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda, Telma Cleotilde Peña Martínez. Present Sweet Dreams. Sweet Dreams. Sleep tight. <laughs> bye bye. Bye. Ok. Hi, Glenda. Teacher, how are you? I'm doing great. Esa es la primera vez que estamos en una sesión de 10 minutos. Can you hear me? Sí, sí, le escucho bien, súper bien. Bien, como es la primera vez que estamos juntos en una sesión, eh, yo suelo iniciar la primera vez con dos preguntas bien básicas en español. La primera, ¿cuál ha sido su experiencia con el inglés? O sea, ¿desde dónde lo viene aprendiendo? Eh, ¿Y cuánto tiempo lleva acá en la academia, no? Eh, y la segunda, pues, ¿qué estoy haciendo yo, Glenda? Des, aparte de estas dos horas, ¿qué más hago para mejorar mi inglés? Si gusta, puede apagar la cámara, Glenda, para que no, no le interfiera con la señal. Tal vez le mejora la señal un poco. No logré escuchar bien eh, uh -huh. lo que me dijo. Solo okay. se, me, se me desconectó. Es que tengo problemas cuando enciendo la cámara. Ah, apagué la cámara, no se preocupe, es lo que les estoy diciendo. Ay, okay, sí. Vaya. Ok, Bye. le preguntaba do, dos cosas nada más. ¿Cuál ha sido su experiencia con el inglés hasta ahora? ¿Cuánto tiempo lleva en la academia? Y la otra, pues, ¿qué está haciendo aparte de las dos horas clase? ¿Qué más hace para mejorar su inglés? Eh, estoy desde, con respecto a la primera pregunta, estoy desde el año pasado, el módulo desde el 1 al 5, no, al 4. Uh -huh. ¿Intermedio? Sí. Mm, okay. y, y sinceramente este, este módulo no, no me sentía preparada a hacerlo en este momento porque se me dificulta horriblemente, siento que está súper pesado. Y me está costando mucho llevar el nivel de, 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 del, del tiempo, sobre todo, y, y de lo que es del contenido. A veces yo me pierdo mucho. Uh -huh. Ok. Y no sé, o sea, ya analizó bien su tiempo. Um, a ver, ¿qué horas puede dedicarle un poco más de tiempo al inglés? Fíjese que por lo pronto... Yo hablaba con Recursos Humanos que, que había pensado suspender estos dos últimos módulos porque mm. yo estoy sola con mis dos niñas y me cuesta mucho organizar tanto las actividades de mi niña grande con, con mis clases ahora. Mm -hmm. Y sí, tenía el tema, pero ya me habían inscrito. Entonces mm -hmm. estoy haciendo mi máximo esfuerzo porque... Mm -hmm. Sí, o sea, siento que, no, que, que me está costando mucho. ¿Y, no, ¿Y a qué grado van las niñas? A tercer grado va la más grande y la más chiquita que tiene tres años. Ay, ok. ¿Y quién la cuida, la niña, la pequeña? Por ahorita no tengo la persona que me apoyaba, me, uh -huh. se me fue. Ajá. Y eso es lo que me ha complicado más. Híjole, ¿y está trabajando desde madre. casa, Glenda? No. Yo voy a la oficina, a veces vengo manejando cuando me he logrado conectar, eh, me conecto, trato lo más posible de, que, de conectarme, vengo a hacer la cena, darle de comer y, y estoy en clase y haciendo todo. ¿Para qué, quiere, bueno, ¿Para qué quiere aprender inglés, Glenda? ¿Cuál es el propósito de aprender inglés? Realmente eh, estaba buscando una mejora. Una oportunidad, yo trabajé como consultora de impuestos en una firma internacional, entonces el inglés era como un tema que yo lleva, tenía que llevar de la mano y me esforcé por, por, por aprenderlo y me ha gustado mucho, yo créame que los, los módulos anteriores sí hice el máximo esfuerzo de organizarme y, y gracias a Dios lo lograba, pero en esta circunstancia este módulo me está costando mucho y no es que me queje eh, de, de la metodología, a mí me gusta cómo se interactúa, pero <risa> Me quedo corta, o sea, me, mi vocabulario es muy, muy, muy poco. Y ahí viene la respuesta de la segunda pregunta. 
en el día es bien difícil ahorita para mí, con las funciones que tengo, realmente enfocarme a, a, a realizar mis tareas, porque incluso tengo mi cuaderno con la técnica que nos, bueno, un tip que nos dijo al principio de las clases, cinco verbos en los tres tiempos, y sí lo, 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 lo retomé, porque sí lo tengo, pero ya en estos, ¿qué? Semana y media casi no he logrado avanzar, pero sí, este... No, okay. es que no quiera. <risas> Mire, llevo yo siete años dando clases. Su historia la he escuchado varias veces. Muchas. Algunas más complicadas que otras. Tenía una, una alumna que está en clases presenciales. Una alumna con cáncer en el estómago. Eh, Ay, Dios mío. Pero no solo eso, espéreme. O sea, la mujer estaba enferma. Encima, enfermera y... ¿Cómo se llama esto? Anestesióloga. Entonces, y para mm. ganar buen dinero siendo anestesióloga, le tocaba agarrar Exacto. turnos de la mm -hmm. nada. Así que a las 11, 12 de la noche, venite. Y los doctores ya sabían que ella estaba siempre disponible para ir. Pero siempre iba a dejar a, sus hija, a su hija al colegio. La iba a traer. Después, o sea, era una mujer que pasaba 24-7 trabajando. Y aún sí. así... Y aún pero, así, eh, no sé cómo hacía, pero me siguió esa dieta desde el básico 1, creo que hasta el básico 6 estuve con ella. Eh, o sea, sí se puede. Sí. ¿Y sabes qué es lo más lindo? Y bueno, una cosa, entender lo, lo, lo bonito. ¿Por qué será que cuando nos proponemos hacer algo, la vida se nos complica más? Y más, y más. No es mentira. Eh, le pongo mi caso, yo estoy intentando rebajar de peso a mis 40 años otra vez, hace 7 años lo logré, hace 7 años, no, quiero ver, hace 5 años logré bajar casi 40 libras en 3 meses, en 3 meses, en 3 meses, ¿cómo le hice? Me convencí yo mismo, todos los días, todos los días, todos los días de que de que era una persona saludable, que, que yo tenía el six pack para el final del año, y todos los días me repetí, ese, me repetí ese mantra, todos los días. Se le invito a eso, convénzase, o sea, a mí me pasó de pequeño, yo simplemente me repetía que, que, que quería hablar inglés, que quería salir de la pobreza en la que crecí, yo solo me lo repetía, me lo, inconscientemente, no me pregunte cómo, pero los 15, 16 años, yo empecé a los 7 con un diccionario aprendiendo inglés, y a los 16, 17 estaba hablando y me di cuenta que tenía una base para el inglés y mi vida se fue complicando cada más en términos de crecimiento ahora que quiero adelgazar se me está complicando las cosas no puedo ni lavar platos con esta mano con la mano derecha porque se me hincha esta parte o sea, y de la nada o sea, y por qué de repente estas cosas eh, y así entonces la invito a eso ¿por qué? porque la gratificación después entre más cuestan las cosas, huela, es más, ya, es más grande el premio. Es como, no sé, alguien me decía, otra amiga que tenía que, que se unió a un grupo religioso, no sé qué, fue un retiro, y a los dos meses de haber hecho el retiro, eh, le diagnostican cáncer, otra historia de cáncer. Dos años en tratamiento, y le dijeron, bueno, o te quitamos el, el, el útero, o pasas por quimio por dos años, y optó por la quimio. Sí. Entonces, o sea, y así un montón de casos, pero el punto es ese, a mí me, me da cosa ver que la vida lo prepara uno, porque ella me dice, bueno, si sí. no hubiera ido a ese retiro, si no hubiera vivido lo que viví, quizás la vida me estaba preparando para ese golpe, ¿verdad? Y en el caso, en el caso de lo que yo he vivido en muchos, muchos alumnos, es que es como cuando más les ha costado aprender inglés, es cuando mayor es la recompensa después me salen con que mire estoy trabajando aquí y les doy el consejo porque el consejo que les doy imagínense mis alumnos métanse un call center experimenten hablar, 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 hablar todo el día y a los seis meses, un año busquen otro call center donde les paguen mejor dos años después ya están listos terminen su carrera en la universidad prepárense para ser profesores si están trabajando en el call center trabajen de profesores uff ya está hecho o sea Sí. No, de hecho, eh, me, me, me motivó mucho cuando trabajé en este lugar, cuatro años, yo cero inglés, créame que cero inglés, y es una firma de auditoría que, que es internacional, y yo tenía el servicio 
de clientes en, en España, en el Reino Unido, en India y, y no me recuerdo otro país, pero las conversaciones universales por política de la firma eran en inglés. Uh -huh. Entonces yo empecé a, a trabajar con Google Translate porque, bueno, pues no tenía una manera de... de Menos mal que era escrito. Y de... <risa> pues eso es lo que le quería terminar de contar, <risa> de que yo quizás en esa experiencia, cuatro años en ese tema, yo leo, yo, yo puedo traducir, bueno, trato, intento de traducir o lo interpreto de una manera mucho más fácil, uh -huh. pero el problema es, como no, no, nunca logré conversar con nadie, el hablado a mí me pone, se me, se me corta el vocabulario, exacto, porque después me quedo pensando, yo hago mis frases en, en, en mi mente, pero no me salen cuando quiero platicarles. Por eso esa dieta Entonces, funciona, porque es algo inconsciente, sí. por pura inercia. Es que mire, la clave es la repetición. Es cualquier acción que usted lleve a cabo repetidamente a diario, la convierte en disciplina. Y esa, eh, eh, inconscientemente, es, nos programamos. Si no, no me crea a mí que le pase en la mañana cuando suena la alarma. Ah, me vuelvo a dormir. <risa> no, la vuelvo a pagar. <risa> ¿Qué, pasa, ¿Qué pasa después de un par de días? Fíjese que es bien crítica esa situación. Mucha no gente no, no piensa en eso. Pero uno usualmente se levanta y dice, puchica, ¿qué? Y se dice malas cosas uno mismo. Qué huevón soy, qué perezoso, qué barbaridad conmigo. Ya no puedo con esta situación. Entonces, el cerebro atiende y dice, bueno, soy perezoso, soy perezoso, soy perezoso. Es cierto. <risa> No, hombre, pero se puede, yo la animo de verdad, Dios le va a ayudar, ya va a ver, tiene hijas, o sea, puchica, no, 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 no. Oh, ese no, sacrificio. Le, le, yo sí le digo a mi niña, a la más chiquita, a la más grande, perdón, te voy a meter a clases de inglés aquí en CNUS para que practiquemos, porque yo no tengo con quién practicarle, entonces ya entre las dos nos vamos a poner a platicar, porque a mí sé que yo no te entiendo qué me decís, porque a veces le, <ríe> yo trato de, de decirle algo en inglés, yo no te entiendo mamá, me dice... <ríe> Pero bueno. si no, créame que motivada sí estoy, solo que quizás me, me he convencido de que estoy cansada. Y eso es lo que me quiero quitar de mentalidad. Cuesta. Es el primer bloqueo. Es el primer bloqueo, y, pero sí es físico. Y fíjese que yo me quito el cansancio haciendo ejercicio. Buscando, yo no puedo estar sin hacer nada. Desde pequeño tengo esa, a veces de gracia, digo yo, pero... Es que es un problema. Soy tan obstinado que me meto a hacer algo. Por ejemplo, ahorita en lo que se convierte el video, atrapear. Boy. ¿Y por qué? Porque, porque no me gusta estar aquí sentado esperando. O sea, se tarda como 30 minutos en la máquina. Entonces, ¿qué hago? Ah, pues, ¿cuál sí. que hacer? No sé, es como costumbre ¿verdad? no desaprovechar el tiempo. Pero bueno, ánimo y cualquier cosa. Escríbame si necesita algún otro tip. De verdad, esto es para ayudarle en todo lo que pueda. Yo sé que... que pues, usted es la que más necesita en este, en este escenario, ¿no? Sí. Ya va a ver que se puede. Ánimo, ¿ok? Gracias. Entonces, feliz noche. Gracias. Good night. Feliz noche, Good night.